this is what we're working with today. Nothing different from the other days, maybe a little less. Hi, it's Grace, and today I'm going to be making myself into a mixture of Jack Skellington and Sally, just to see what it looks like. I've wanted to try this for a while, but I haven't really been too sure which way I wanted to do it. So I decided on Jack's eyes, Sally's lips, and then I'll see what it needs after that. I think I'm just going to have to make it up as I go along. So I have my hair up because I don't want to deal with it right now. I tried to tone the roots out again and the colour just took to my hair. So now it's purple again. <laughs> I'll deal with it another day. I'll wear a wig today. It'll be fine. I'm going to start off with a sticky primer and a different white face paint base because all the whites that I've tried this month have been really patchy and blotchy and awful. So I'll see if I can get this to work properly. That seems like a lot. I guess I have to do a pretty big area. It might not be enough. Nope, that seems to have been just enough. And I'm in my dressing gown again today. It seems like a good way to start makeup videos. Actually, most videos. I don't have to get dressed then. It's one less thing I've got to worry about. I'll be picking an outfit later. Actually, maybe both. Maybe I'll take pictures in Jack's outfit and Sally's outfit and see which one I like better. That sounds like a lot more fun. All right, do I need to wait for this to dry a lot? Probably not. Feels a bit sticky already. This is just a really, really, really cheap base paint from a discount store. I didn't want to spend a lot of money in case I didn't like it. So this, hopefully, is good. I don't know. Oh, I think my brush just broke. Oh well. Don't think I like this stuff either. I'm gonna try some of my old face paint and a beauty blender. See if I can help this. That doesn't look too bad. I'm going to set it with white eyeshadow because it's better than anything else I've used. I really should buy some white powder one day. One day. I don't know if you can tell. It still looks a little patchy, but it's really shiny because of the eyeshadow. I like it. Time for the eyes. It took me so long to get this off the other day. And now I'm going to have to do it again. At least I know what I'm in for. I'm going to try and make them a little bit smaller than the other day. They got a little out of hand. Put some stitches on. I drew all these with pencil and then went over the top of them with powder and I know it looks a bit plain but I think I learned the other day that too much shading really didn't look that good. So I'm going to put some lips on and a wig and get dressed. That was a little bit too easy. This is a really good idea for Halloween. This is how it looks all done. I am so happy with it. It does look a lot cleaner than the other day, apart from like the smudgy bits where my dressing gown rubbed on my paint, which wasn't a good idea. But I think it looks good. Um, the dress kind of works. I think I'll try on the Jack outfit. I think it's going to look a lot better. I'll take pictures of everything to show you. But here it is, kind of finished, and I like it. I wonder if my eyelids are creased a little bit. Okay, I'll flatten them out. Brush somewhere. All right, how did that look? Does it look all right? I need to take pictures. I can't see with my eyes shut, obviously. So maybe this is a good pose. Hopefully that'll look good. I will see you tomorrow for day 30. I can't believe this is nearly over already. 
but I'll be grateful when it is. I kind of need a break. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.